morning, and welcome to another edition of HPTV News. My name is Ariana Barr. And I am Joe Castle. This Thursday night is our first family event of the school year. It is our High Point Family Fall Ball Night. Since the characters in our One School, One Book, A Whole New Ball Game, play on a basketball team, we are celebrating our basketball skills with a fun and competitive evening of basketball challenges. This event will take place Thursday evening from 5 to 6 p.m. Let's go to our field reporters who have more information about the exciting family event. Family Fireball will take place this Thursday from 5 through 6 p.m. in our new gym. Please have your grown-ups RSVP if you are planning to attend. If you have let us know you are coming during school on Thursday, you will receive raffle tickets with your name on it. Please bring them with you to Family Fall Ball. You will use these raffle tickets to enter yourself into raffles to get chosen to compete in different basketball challenges like free throw, shooting contest, dribbling challenges, three-point contest, and more, while your friends and family cheer you on. The PFE will also be selling items to help cheer the crowd on, like pom-poms and noisemakers. Bring cash if you are interested in buying any of these items. We hope to see you and your family there. The character trait for the month of September has been courage. This month, High Point staff members have paid close attention to the students who went above and beyond showing courage throughout the month. These students were selected as our September students of the month. They are Dev P, Mia M, Zaina A, Nadine S, Hadley I, Alexandria A, Ileana R, Dominic G, Riley S, Connor Z, Ahana T, Autumn D, Joanna S, Ryan L, Thomas S, Carson K, Mia R, Chloe I, Eliana H, Harold L, Jad J, and Naima S. Tomorrow's the first day of October, which means we will have a new character trait to focus on for the month. The character trait for October is friendship. It is important to be a a good friend to others. How do you show friendship, Ariana? I make sure to be a good friend by listening to others and being kind. Let's see how some of our other High Point students show friendship. Our field reporters are asking them now. I'm, today I'm here with Gavin. What's a good way to be a friend? Um, be kind, respectful, and don't just make them be your friend so you can play pranks on them and make him laugh or make them go to school or embarrass them in life. Hello, today I'm here with Coraline. Coraline, what is one way to be a good friend? You gotta listen to their opinions and make sure you listen to their feelings. Hello, today I'm here with James. What is one way a friend can show that they're a good friend to you? Um, that they can always stick up for everybody and compliment them or help them when they're hurt. This Friday, the Hornetbuck store will be celebrating its grand opening for the 2024-2025 school year. This week, the third grade students will be shopping. To prepare for shopping, please be sure to have your Hornetbucks counted out and organized so you know exactly how much money you have to spend. Our field reporters are with Miss Nimchek now to find out more about this school year's Hornetbuck store. Hello, today I'm here with Miss Nimchek. Can you explain to us what the Hornet store is? Absolutely. Thanks for asking, Hayden. The Hornet store is where you get to spend all of the Hornet bucks you've earned by being responsible and being engaged in your learning and being a good Hornet. Okay. There are four different amounts for the Hornet store. Ones are yellow this year. Fives are green. Tens are pink. And blues are 20 this year. Okay, so when the Hornet store is set up and it's your grade's turn to shop, there's all the different tables with the different amounts of uh, m money you can spend for different prizes. So over here at the tens table, okay, and 25s table, we have lots of different water bottle stickers that will be spread out for you, okay? We also have erasers and bookmarks. Those are always 10, okay? Our pencils and pencil grips are 25 Hornet bucks. Okay, let's say, let's say Joe here wanted, okay, th uh, uh, 
three bookmarks, okay? He's going to give me $30, okay? And whatever your item is, Hornets, you need to make sure you pay for it at that table before you move on, okay? So he gave me exact change. If you only have 20s or bigger amounts, I'll give you change as well, okay? Over here, this half of the middle table is 50s. Uh, $50 amounts. We have sunglasses this year, stress balls, pencil cases, and different mochis. Okay. The 75 side of the table has these really cool stress balls. These go fast. Okay. Um, different friendship bracelets and different types of slime. All of these are options for 75. And the prizes will kind of swap out as the year goes on. Okay, over at this last table, okay, are the $100 and big ticket items. So we have some hacky sacks, we have these really cool Chicago Bears pens, and the putty is back. Okay, so we have the putty for 100 At this table as well, over on this side, uh, you can buy the big ticket items, such as leading the announcements for the entire school in the morning, Okay, doing three, purchasing 3D printing, purchasing your own segment on the newscast, doing your own podcast episode, um, and also doing Friday DJ. Okay, all of that information for those big ticket items is a hundred plus dollars and you can look at in the Hornet Bucks menu. Make sure you keep working hard to earn all those Hornet Bucks. Hi, I'm here with the members of the Pioneers football team. They are. My name is Tyler and I play running back and this is my second year. Uh, um, my name is Dominic. I, I play I play football for three years and, and I play for tight end. Hi, my name is Vito. Uh, I played for two years linebacker. Hi, my name is Gavin. I'm a QB and I've been playing for three years. Hi, my name is James. I've been playing for three years and I play left tackle. Hi, my name is Colin. I've been and this is my second year and I play tackle. Hi, my name is Sam, and I've been playing for two years, and I play as linebacker. Hi, my name is Michael, and I've been playing for two years, and my position is defensive end. Hi, my name is Michael. I've been playing for one year, and I play left tight end. Hi, my name is Luke. I've been playing for five years, and I play quarterback. Hi, my name is Owen. I've been playing for four years, and I play linebacker. Hi, yeah, my name is Adam. I've been playing for four years, and I play running back. Hi, my name is Michael, and I'm running back, and I've been playing for four years. Hi, my name is CJ, and I've been playing for two years, and I play um, left linebacker. Hi, my name is Paul. I've been playing for three years, and my position that I play is quarterback. My name is Lawson. I've been playing for one year, and my position is right guard. Hello, my name is JJ, and I've been playing for two years, and my and I play lineman. Hi, my name is Lorcan, and I've been playing for one year, and I play um, center. Hi, my name is Patrick, and I've been playing for, this is my first year, and I do um, left tackle. Hi, my name is Luke, and I've been playing for one year, and my position is tight. Hi, my name is Noah. I've been playing for three years, and my position is tackle. Hi, my name is Bradley. I've been playing for one year, and my position is running back. Hi, my name is Thomas, and I've been playing for four years, and my position is tight end. What is your record for the season? Our record is 5-1. and one. What's your favorite part about playing football? Bodying people. How often do you practice per week? We practice two times a week. How many more games do you have this year? We have three more games. Thanks for tuning in. This has been Elliot, Matthew, Ariana, Joe, and Hayden signing off. Have a wonderful day. This newscast brought to you by the High Point Media Team.